Hi everybody, Bob with Knives Town here. Today we're going to take a look at a buck knife. It is the Buck Vantage Avid. And that's a folding knife made in the USA. And, and look at this. The measure of a knife since 1902. That pretty much says it all. And you know, if you've been in business that long, you know you've got to be doing something right. The knife ships with some literature, which is basically uh, the uh, product of just uh, the knife care, knife sharpening, and then um, and then inside here, it's uh, it opens up and it's it, it's a, a questionnaire. And you can complete this, and send, and then when you fold it up, it becomes an envelope. And you send it off to Buck and um, help them out with their market research. Uh, it, the knife does come with a with what uh, with Buck's forever warranty, which is a lifetime warranty on uh, parts and workmanship. There you go. Technical specs. That blade is three and a quarter inches long, and it's uh, the steel is a 13C26 Sandvik. The closed length is four and three eighths inches. The weight is four ounces. The blade is three millimeters thick. And that keeps its thickness the entire length of the blade. It's a hollow ground drop point. That handle, you may be noticing that, uh, the handle is made of diamond wood. And if you're not familiar with that, diamond wood is, a, is an interesting product. Uh, it's, it's half wood, half plastic, really, is, is what it is. Uh, what they do is they start with a, a sixteenth of an inch thick veneer of real hard wood, typically birch or something like that, and, and they vacuum impregnate dyes and uh, as well as uh, acrylic and polycarbonate resins into the wood so it goes deep into the cellular structure. Then they take, they stack atop each other numerous layers of that veneer and then they compress it under heat and high pressure. And, and the final result you get is, is diamond wood and, and that's, you know, I mean, it, it's like I say, it's, it's a half wood, half plastic. It, it looks, it's got the beauty of wood, but the dimensional stability, uh, heat resistance, and weather resistance of plastic. So it's really a great material to use for a knife scale. And this particular, uh, I mean, you can get it in different finishes. This is the, the Avid model that, that looks this way. Um, but, uh, and then it has, you know, it has some, some design, uh, you know, cut into it as well here with these lines. The uh, Buck Anvil logo is there on the knife. Those are T6 Torx head screws. And the pivot is a T6 also. Comes with a pocket clip that has the Buck Anvil on it. And that is a low rider. Yes, sir. That will disappear in your pocket. That uh, that can be removed with two T6 screws on the on the bottom there, and and the 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 clip can be could be spun around and put on this side here if you wanted. It's a liner lock. There's no jimping on that, but but in order to get good purchase on it, the handle, the scale is cut away a little bit there, so so that the so that it is easy to get to it. So you can see that it, there's there's no problem getting to it.
Buck is known for making a good sharp knife, and this is no exception. That is a sharp blade. They make a good sharp knife. I've never been disappointed in a buck knife. The, uh, the, the knife can be opened in a couple of ways. Uh, it does come, as you can see there, with a, a, a thumb hole or thumb slot there. So you can certainly use that to open it. And of course that works just as well, you know, with either hand. But the, uh, the knife also does have a, uh, a flipper there on the back, so it can be opened that way too. And then in the open position, the flipper makes uh, a finger guard. As far as the ergonomics go, you can see the handle there. It, it's a traditional handle, and it does have a, a, a bit of a rise here for your thumb. You know, and then down here you've got the, the flipper acting as a finger guard, so you've got good safety there. You've got good safety. You know, I mean, this is a knife meant for, for someone who knows what they're doing. It's got a handsome, attractive look to it. You know, it's not... Uh, It's not trying to be the toughest guy on the block or something, you know. I mean, it's just a it's just a good-looking, regular, down-to-earth knife. All right, that is the Buck Vantage Avid. Well, thanks for watching. I'll see you again.